Summer is just around the corner and we all want to know how to get that bikini body. So we've brought in Victoria's Secret model Erin Heatherton, who is also the face of Victoria's Secret Sport, so she knows all about how to stay fit and healthy. Hello Erin. Hey, thanks for having me. Thanks for being here. So how did you get involved with Victoria's Secret Sport? My background was playing sports in high school. I was always an athlete. From when I was walking I played basketball and I ran track. So. Really that part of modeling and that part of staying in shape was kind of second nature to me. I'm pretty much a walking advertisement for VSX. So as the face of Victoria's Secret Sport, I mean, do you work out all the time? Are you just constantly in the gym? I think all of us work out um, a, a good amount more or less. I think that for me it's like, it's a big stress reliever. Mm -hmm. I love to go for a run, I love to do yoga, it's my one hour of the day where I can just like quiet my mind. My life is really crazy and to have that routine every day where I do an hour of something the same is really nice. So what are some of your favorite workouts or tips that you have for staying in shape in the summer? For me it's really the it's really the running. Mm -hmm. I run for half an hour mm -hmm. and I, then I do yoga. Having that time where I quiet my mind and reduce stress that okay. has the biggest effect on my body. Yeah that's really important and how long do you do yoga for? A half an hour. Half an hour. So half hour run, half hour yoga. Yeah. Perfect. That's and like is the it just... golden combination to me, I think. I think it's a great way to explore a city is to go for a run. Yeah, you know? I do too, actually. So speaking of traveling, what are some of your travel tips when you don't have a trainer around? I did start Pure Bar, actually, when I was at, um, traveling. Okay. And so sometimes I'll Google a yoga studio mm -hmm. or see and just try a new class or try something different. And that's always, it's fun to try something new. Is there a particular body part that you obsess over? I always tell my trainer to do my waist and my legs. And I want to just always tone my legs. We all know that food plays a big role in, in how we look and feel. So what are some things that you eat or don't eat to get bikini ready? Yeah, it's, it's funny because I met Cindy Crawford once and she said something to me I'll never forget. She said it's it's really not always about working out. It's the most important thing is what you eat. That really changed my perspective because it is about eating the right things. I don't eat gluten also. Oh, okay, so you're gluten free. Yeah. Are you vegetarian as well? No, or no? not so at all. It up. It up. No, I love fish and chicken and I'll eat bacon too sometimes. Oh, there you go. <laughs> I was gonna ask you if you ever have cheat days, so I'm assuming that's your, yeah, I'll that's cheat. your little cheat. <laughs> I'll cheat on like meat and cheese. You can't stress too much about it. Um, I work out and I eat right and if I'm not, I can't be too hard on myself about making mistakes or whatever. It's like I do my best. Exactly. So that's all I can do. We all do. Thanks so much, Erin. Thank you so much for having me. Of course, of course. Let us know some of your favorite summer workout tips in the comments. We'll see you next time on Fit Sugar TV.